What time is it? You know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. Where is it at? Right there, right there. And it's time to follow my Instagram, Geekly Amanda. G-E-E-K-L-Y. Amanda, same on Twitter. And it's time to get this reaction started. Yesterday I was browsing the internet and I came across a story. It talked about the, the, the delivery systems, the Uber Eats and the Grubhubs and the DoorDash. And it was asking some questions about, you know, how many people have sampled the food that they gotten. I didn't even think about this kind of stuff, but it got me wondering, you know, the process, how they hire the people and all that. So you know what I did? I did some research. I did some research and I went and applied for the Uber Eats. Now let me tell you the stuff they asked for. They asked for like a picture of your driver's license. So I just took a little picture, sent it. They wanted a picture of my insurance card. Did that. They wanted a picture of me. So you know that was that took the amount of time because I had to get my 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 selfie game on and all that kind of stuff. So I took a picture of me. And then they wanted to a picture of my registration, my car registration. So I sent that in. Sent it all in. It was about 2 p.m. Now I I was I was invested after I sent this stuff in. I was checking like every 30 minutes. When I checked, I saw that my driver's license was accepted. And my profile picture. I was like, they are moving fast on this. That was so I started, I applied at two two o'clock. And that went in. And then not even 30 minutes later, it said that my car insurance was accepted. Now I was really in to, to get clearance. You have to they have to clear your driver's license, has to clear your insurance card, clear your profile pic. Those three were done. Now it had to clear my registration and background. I had gotten an email popped up up that my in, my registration wasn't accepted, and it was because it was an expired date. I wasn't paying attention. I was doing this for fun, right? Took a picture of it, just whatever was my car. I found the new one, and it got me thinking. Well, they really are paying attention to stuff. They ain't just accepting nothing. They're looking at the registrations and running the things. So I sent the updated uh, registration and about 30 minutes later, it was accepted. Then all I had to wait for my, my background check. Now it's about 4.30 or so, four, maybe five o'clock in the afternoon. And I was like, wow, I don't, I don't see this being accepted tonight. Yeah, the other stuff that that got accepted like right away within the two or three hours. But for a background check, I mean, don't they need the fingerprints and and run face IDs and the criminal? I, I don't know. I did go on and Google how long background checks usually take, and they say like two to three days. I was like, well, that's acceptable. They want to thoroughly do all this up two or three days in the meantime though this got to my clocks to working this got my clocks are working up in my head i was like this sounds like fun <laughs> how come i think delivering some uber eats sounds like fun and maybe i want to steal a fry i ain't gonna do it if i'm an uber eat y'all listen your food's safe with me it's gonna be tempting this might be bad for me because I might like go to pick up something and be like, throw in the order of fries for me with that because that's going to be tip. I might, Uber Eats might have made me gain weight, but I was like, this would be fun. And to think of like the stuff you're going to come across. Her people don't like to tip, but listen, when they get Uber Eats from me, they're going to get a song and dance for the tip. <laughs> I'm going to, I'm going to deliver that Uber Eats with song. Yes, I'm talking about deliver. I want to try this out. I want to try out delivering the Uber Eats. Then it got my wheels to turn and I was like, I can totally start a, a Twitter, a crazy Amanda Uber Eats, and, or, or even another like sub channel on my YouTube, crazy Amanda Uber Eats, and just film like my adventures on the Uber Eats. I could talk about it. I was like, I could do, I want to do this to now start a YouTube channel, tweet about it, my Uber Eats adventures. I was excited. I was going to still take a couple days for them to, to enroll me because they got to do the background checks. Talk about at 9 o'clock p.m. I already have my bra off. So that means when my when that comes off, that means I'm done for the day. D that comes off and ain't going back on. All right. That I was done for the day. But I get a message, a text alert on my thing. 
your application's accepted, everything, you're approved you, for an Uber Eats driver. So you talking about, I applied at two and at 9 p.m., seven hours later from just the application, I'm seven hours later, I'm an Uber Eats driver. And this is with, this is on top of having not done it right because I didn't send in the right registration. So this is adding some time because they had to get the right registration. I am now an Uber Eats driver seven hours later. I've been looking at stuff, you know, Uber Eats drivers are not like other food delivery things. It's kind of like Uber. You text, you can text the people and be like, they're supposed to meet you right on the curb. You don't even bring it to the door. You don't even have to get out your car. You can roll down the window, be like, there's your Uber Eats. I'm not going to do that. I will get out the car and deliver for them because they better give me a tip. <laughs> I put in park, open, took my seatbelt off. Because I, I only Uber Eats safe. You better wear your seatbelts. I will put the seatbelt on the bag too. I'm not even, no. We're we going to get your food to you safe. And, and crazy Amanda Uber Eats. But I will get out my car. I did all that. You better give me. I'm going to be mad if people don't give a tip. The biggest thing I see that's going to be a problem is the food smelling good. Well, there's two. Someone said the food smelling good. I can see. If I'm hungry, like I can't Uber eat, I can't go Uber eat a drive on with an empty stomach. I know I'm going to have to have snacks and refreshments on my drives because it will be tempting, but I'm not going to, I won't steal your food. I'm, I'm not going to steal your food. Your food's going to get to you safe, but it's got, that smell's going to hit you and it's going to be tempting. But if the smooth food smells bad, going to be stinking up your car. I didn't even think of this. But that's a good point. So this is all stuff coming. All stuff coming to the crazy Amanda Uber Eats. Gonna be on Twitter. Gonna be up on the YouTubes. Gonna be getting videos. Maybe just one. Well, <laughs> maybe I'll just do it for one delivery and, and be like, I'm done with this. But at least you know the application process. And, and I don't know how it is in your area. But up where I am, they must need them pretty bad. They must need them pretty bad. Seven hours later, I'm an Uber Eats driver. So there you go.